Gunk presents Tips for Using Gunk Brake Parts Cleaner. Hi, I'm Dr. Larry Beaver of RSC Chemical Solutions, and I'm here today at Central Piedmont Community College with Ken Collins, director of the program here, and we're here to demonstrate for you the Gunk Brake Parts Cleaner in a real brake job. So Ken, what's in store for us today? Well first Larry, I'd like to welcome you here to the Joe Hendrick Center in Matthews, North Carolina. And we're going to take a look at this new gunk brake parts cleaner for you. And for, we're going to take this wheel and this drum off and we're going to clean it out real good and we're going to lubricate it up to show the folks how well this product works. You want to give me an idea what uh, products we have here to show the folks? Sure Ken, we've got a chlorinated gunk brake parts cleaner and that's for really tough jobs, things that are really greasy and grimy. And the gunk non-chlorinated brake cleaner is for those jobs in areas of the country where chlorinated solvents are restricted. And then of course we've got the Squeal Medic product and that's for application inside the drums or on the rotors after the installation. And what that does is it cuts down on squeaks and squeals as the new pads wear in. Well I think we're going to need this chlorinated stuff today Larry. Oh I think so. <laughs> Well, there we got the wheel off, so let's go ahead and pop this drum off. Great. Oh, it loosened right up. Yes, it did. Whoa. Wow. There's I think a lot he, of slack. Yeah, I think he's got a little leak in his wheel cylinder, doesn't he? Yes, he does. Let's clean it up a little bit. There you go. Where do you want me to start at, Larry? Well, anytime you've got a leak, you want to clean the area around where the leak occurred. I'm going to get a rag right here. And That removes all the brake fluid residue and any oil or grease that's worked out from the hub. Larry, we got quite a bit of wheel cylinder oil in here. You think that we're going to be able to get this cleaned up to where we can use this drum again? That cylinder really leaked in there, but the gunk brake cleaner will take it right out. Well, I've got some right here. I've got the chlorinated brakes parts cleaner. And let's, let's give it a shot. That'll do it. All right. Anytime you're doing a brake job, cleaning out the brake area, around the caliper, the cylinder, the drum and the rotor is important to get rid of any of this residual fluid. I know it's important to get along this um, face right here where the shoe's going to actually ride and, and stop, but I, really we need to get it off of this area right in here too, don't we? Yeah, you don't want it working its way down onto that, uh, down onto that bearing surface where the, uh, where the pad rides. And really, we didn't use that much of that cleaner either. Look nope. at this shining right up nice. Yeah, the chlorinated solvent really cuts the old brake fluid and any grease or oil that was in there. That's one of the places that chlorinated solvent really shines, is removing that kind of residue. Is there something that we're going to spray in here afterwards? or? Yeah, on this kind of uh, drum, mm -hmm. you'd put a squeal medic product on that inner surface where the, where the shoe rides. Or where the shoe's going to ride. Yeah, right and, the, and that as it breaks in eliminates the squeal and, and it's often common from the... Well, you know, you can have a new, customer complain on that one. Yeah, yeah, it eliminates customer callbacks. Well, I think we're all cleaned up here pretty good. Looks good to me, Larry. Looks great. Well, Larry, thanks for coming in and showing us these gunk products. We're all cleaned up, we're ready to go. I know we can buy these products at local parts stores. Is there any other outlets? Yeah, Ken, there is. Home centers, retail outlets, nationwide carry the gunk products. And for more information, you can go to gunk.com.